So we've got the engine check light on. So we come down OBD2 socket. Just pull that up from underneath. It's held on like that. Okay. Get your reader. I've got a Foxwell NT301. Which is basic, but good enough for this. She's alive. Right. Oh, yeah, this is not touch screen, sorry. Right, so read and oh, no. up. Enter. Right, so read codes. Enter. <clears throat> so I'm going to focus on that, but it's stored codes. We got PO, uh, sorry, P0402. Exhaust gas recirculation flow excessive detected. And there's one more because it's one of two codes. P01 P0130 O2 sensor circuit bank, which I think is pretty common on these, although I've never changed it. So I think. We'll go and have a look under the bonnet because we I've already researched this. Uh right. Let's go under the bonnet. That's that one. Oh shiny. We have to get him off and his plug. Is that is that one? I need to slice off this little mountain bracket button. Okay, so I didn't capture it on the video, but basically there's an it's an awkward space. I can't film that. If you imagine that's in the exhaust or manif exhaust manifold, wherever it is, you basically need a tool to get it off. Well, this one is deep seated, and so you get a tool like that, goes over the cables, or through the ca uh, the cable goes through the slot. Okay, and that drops down onto it. Get the right size. This one's a 22 mil, and then you want to put a ratchet in there. This one's a 3 8. Let me grab that. And obviously, lefty loosey, righty tighty. That'll take it off. I mean, obviously, if you're only taking one out, it doesn't. You could cut the wires, but obviously, for putting the new one in, you're going to need the tool. I think. The, I'll show you the tool, sir. So that's it. You've got different types. These are, well, this one is the one I obviously use because these ones on the 22 mil didn't really have enough length for. 
see that by the time you would have got it on, you would have snapped the wires, damaged the wires. I don't know if you can see that. Yeah, like that. So that's why you would do. You would use that. And then ratchet it off. Okay. This set only costs about £13. It's not, I mean, I think this one was 20 but you can get them for 13 quid. But I think if we're going to do, do the one we've done, the Mark IV, you're going to want that. You're not going to get away with these. Yeah, unless you start modifying them, which I wasn't. Okay, so that's the old one off. Yeah, it doesn't look that dirty, does it? Not that bad, but, you know. The new one's the one with the plastic on. There. They're the same length. And... Same pins. So it's still one of two, and two is two, two of two is O2 sensor circuit bank, one sensor, which should be what we've changed. So we're going to delete all the codes, Okay, so I think that was a success. Um, if you you can just delete the codes, obviously, and that will buy you some time, and it will actually sort the the um, the engine running rough problem out, but only for a short period of time. The next sort of day, it will come back on. So hopefully, I mean, this is two uh, two days later, and the light hasn't come back on, so it should be be fixed as far as i'm concerned it's done um 
So if you like this video, please like, comment and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Cheers. And yes, it is cold. <laughs>